The Sidewinder Snake is a venomous pit viper that lives in the desert areas of the southwestern United States and northwestern Mexico. Most snakes have thick scales to protect them from the ground, but in the desert it is obviously very hot, and their scales alone cannot deal with the heat. Over time, snakes have figured out a way to move along the scorching desert floor without burning by sidewinding. This is when a snake moves its body, but only places two parts of its body on the ground at a time. The tripod fish lives on the deep ocean floor, with not much food, such as other small organisms. The fish seems to have developed what some people call a tripod attached to the fish's body. This growth happened because the tripod fish spends most of its life hunting for food, but only eats small organisms. The fish's most efficient way to feed is by planting its three elongated fins into the ground, standing itself up, allowing it to gather lots of food without lots of effort. The spotted salamander is the only photosynthetic invertebrate that lives. This basically means that the salamander can convert the sunlight to energy or food. This is possible by the algae that is literally infused into the salamander's cells. All of the spotted salamanders have this gene, as it's a natural process that occurs when they are still in their eggs. The Killer Mountain Parrot Better known as the Kia, this little bird is in the parrot family and is classified as a parrot. When you think of a parrot, you probably think of the cute ones that talk and eat seeds. But this wild parrot can and will hunt small animals. It lives around New Zealand and the South Islands. It has adapted to its environment and habitat, making it an omnivore. Now it's not a hunter like a hawk or an eagle, but it will attack injured sheep or rabbits, specifically the injured ones. The horned lizard lives exclusively in hot, dry deserts. And in the desert, animals must hunt to survive. Lizards and bugs are usually at the bottom of the food chain, but this lizard has evolved a tactic to guard off predators with its own blood. When scared, the lizard will shoot out a stream of blood straight out of the corner of its eye. The lizard does this to give the attacker a taste of its bad taste of blood, showing that the predator will be better off not eating this lizard. Hippos are the most dangerous animals in Africa, with no real natural predators, besides some occasional lion ambushes and whatnot. This leaves the hippo to worry more about the blazing sun beating down on them. Yes, they have already developed ways to deal with it, like mud or hanging out in rivers and lakes, but now they have traits to passively deal with the heat. Out of small glands around their body, red sweat comes out as a more effective sunscreen. Named as the largest living lizards on Earth, the Komodo dragons are perfect killing machines. The Komodo dragon has very bad hearing, but excellent sight and smell. They can see 985 feet in the distance and can detect movement from that far away. They produce venomous toxins in their saliva and they have very strong claws and muscles. Along with that, they can run up to 12 miles per hour. They usually attack their prey and let their venom kill the victim over the span of a week. During that entire week, the dragon will follow the animal around until it dies. The Scaly Foot Gastropod, a very unusual creature that dwells in the ocean depths. It lives around hydrothermal vents, reaching 750 degrees. It is an ocean floor snail that is heavily armored with a shell made out of iron sulfide. The snail's foot allows it to absorb the calcified materials that come out of the vents and turn it into the metal plated shell and body armor, the perfect way to casually defend yourself at all times. The shike, or loggerhead, is a very small and cute bird that lives throughout North America and Africa. But don't let this innocent looking bird fool you, it has discovered a way to kill its prey without hunting it. The small bird catches insects and small lizards, but instead of killing and eating them on the spot, it brings it to a thorny plant or barbed wire fence and impales the victim, letting it sit and die. They do this because they take very small bites, and by killing it in this fashion, the bird can save their food for later, without eating it in one serving. The mantis shrimp is easily the most developed and pretty dangerous presence underwater. Over time, the mantis shrimp developed claws built to demolish anything it encounters. The claws have been referenced to a gun, as it has the name of pistol shrimp. People call it that because their claws are able to cock back and release an astonishing amount of power in its swing. The swing in fact hits so fast and hard that when contact is made with the claws, a small bubble is formed that creates temperatures hotter than the surface of the sun. Not only that, but the mantis shrimp has the most sophisticated set of eyes, as it has 12 types of photoreceptors, and humans only have three. This gives the shrimp a much bigger view of the world in terms of color and light waves. 